As you can tell from my game, it is extremely slow Dark Task Manager. And look at Java, it's running at a really high memory. Hello everyone, this is Five here, and in this video I'm going to be helping you with a problem I was having a few days ago with the new Ticket Legends mod pack. Now this problem was me trying to play the game and it was just lagging like crazy. I wouldn't even get a single frame, that's how bad it was. No matter what, even if I tried multiplayer or single player, it would lag on both. What I did to fix this is I checked my Java update and I also installed Optifine. And in this video I'm going to be showing you how to do both of them. Now the first thing you want to do is you want to close down this launcher because you do not want anything else running while you're doing this. These are the two programs you'll be needing. Now this one's optional, you don't have to do it, but I would recommend it because it's got better chunk loading than Minecraft. Now what we want to do is we want to check your Java update. We want to go to start and control panel. In here you want to set the view by to small icons and you want to go down to programs and features. The reason why we're looking in here is because it will show us the Java update. First time I was trying to play this mod pack, I had three different versions of Java running at the same time. You want to make sure that you don't have any older versions of Java unless you need them. If you want to know if your computer is running 32 bit or 64 bit, you want to go to star and control panel. In here, you want to go to system and it will say it right here. Now that we've checked which Java version you have and you hopefully deleted the older versions because you don't need to run them, you want to close this and there'll be a link in the description to the official website of Java. You want to accept this and you want to download the 64-bit or the 32-bit depending on your computer. I'll have a link down in the description for both of them. The one you want to download is this one .exe, not that one because that's the wrong version. You want to make sure you get the .exe. You should find another link in the description to Optifine, the official website. You want to scroll down to the correct version, which is this one for Ticket Legends. And download the most recent update of that version, which is the top one. Now that you have Java, just Double click on it and click yes, follow the steps. The next part is installing Optifine. This is the easiest part. You just go to start and type the normal app data percent. To get to roaming, then you want to go to Technic, Mod Packs, Ticket Legends, and Mods. You just simply copy and paste it or just drag it in. I'm not going to do it because I've already got mine right here. Now there is one more thing you really need to do. It's very important because if you don't do it, then it wouldn't work. All of this would have been just for nothing. Go to start, go type in NVI Roman, or just the first letters, and it's the very top one. The reason why we are in here is because there is a script that is not allowing Java to do its best performance. You probably set your RAM, you've probably tried to give Technic more RAM, but it didn't really do anything, and that's why you're lagging because there's a script holding them back. Once you found the Java script, you want to click delete and restart your computer. Now that you've done all the steps, you just simply open the launcher again, go to packs, go to launcher options. In here, you want to go to Java settings. You want to make sure you select the latest version because if you're running on an older version, it will come up here. Next part is memory. I've set mine to four because the total RAM I've got is eight gigabytes. Giving it four should be enough. Don't give it too much. Don't give it seven. You need to make sure that your computer has enough memory to also run desktop, not just the game. Just close this down now. Go to mod pack options and you want to set this to latest version as well. The reason why you need to do this one is because if you don't, then Optifine won't activate and it won't be on. And that's pretty much it. So now you just open the game and see how your changes worked. Now that we're in the game, you can see right here that Optifine is installed. And if you go to mods, it will be right at the top saying available. If it doesn't say available, then there's something wrong. You must have put it in the wrong folder or you must have just installed the wrong version of it. Make sure that this says online. I'll show you by going into options that it's installed. It is right here. You wouldn't normally get these options. I would also copy my settings because they are really good. 
The chunk loaded, I found that smooth was working. I tried multi-core, but it was just flashing. The blocks were flashing, which was really strange. Have that one on smooth. Everything else is fine. You can turn detail like this fast, just so the game runs better. Clouds off. Let's get into single player and show you that it did do what I just told you. A quick start. That was really quick how it loaded. 100 FPS, that's really good. I'm happy with this. I'm really happy with this. Everything is running great. There's a lot of chunks loading, but it just handles it. It can handle this. I hope this video was helpful. Make sure you give it a thumbs up. If it was, it helps others see this video. If you give it a thumbs up, it will help this video get to the top of the page, which then other people with this issue can hopefully find this video and not have to search so much for this. I hope I helped you out. I mean, this was such a pain. I so glad I'm so glad I fixed it. I will see you in my next video. Bye.